for those of you who don't know me, my name is Reddy Kilowatt, and I have been invited by my friends at the Barbados Light and Power Company and the Barbados Museum to tell you a little bit about my friend, Electricity. Where do I start? How about the beginning? Electricity has been around for a very, very long time. Some scientists believe that electricity is as old as the universe, which is 13 billion years old, by the way. And that's a long time. But what exactly is electricity and how does it work? Electricity is a type of energy that is the result of very tiny particles known as electrons and protons interacting with each other. These particles help electricity move from one place to another, such as along or through electric power lines that bring electricity to your house. The type of electricity which we use every day is human-made, but electricity also exists in nature. In the atmosphere, electricity can appear in a static form, but reveals itself to us most dramatically as lightning when we have a storm. Lightning can be both destructive and creative at the same time. Some forest and grass fires which happen on our planet are the direct result of lightning strikes. The fire that results often burn off old vegetation, but in time is replaced by new forests and grasslands. Scientists, known as anthropologists, those are people who study human civilization, have even credited electricity in the form of lightning as first exposing humans to fire. Electricity even exists inside of you, and with the help of chemicals which naturally occur in your body, allow messages to be sent to and from your brain along your nervous system. Electricity in this form helps you to think and respond to the world around you, including this video. Today in 2011, Barbados, the Caribbean and the world are driven by electricity. There is hardly a single device that is not dependent on electricity for its operation. Your cell phone, iPod, laptop computer, hearing aids, the car or bus which brought you here, the airplane or ship which will take you on vacation, the production of the food which you eat all depend on my old friend, electricity. As you walk around the exhibition, I want you to think about how different the world we live in would be if my old friend Electricity did not exist.